It's like 8 a.m. Monday, and I am really feeling the grind right now. I am ready to go bright and early. I'm going to go get breakfast first, but got my comparison ready to go. Put all my uh, Mandalorian sets over here. I need to find my Baby Yoda, Grogu the Child stand. I have no idea what I did with it. So that's a problem. Everything else I should have. Definitely going to build more of the Coliseum because I need to have this done by the end of the week. I did not think it was going to take this long, but I guess I should have noticed the biggest Lego set ever. This is going out to the garage because I already finished the X-Wing comparison. I'm not sure which box this is, but let's find out. Right, so you know me and all my infinite wisdom, when I found out that I was getting that this week or whatever, I went and ordered this because I was worried that I wouldn't be able to find my other one or that it would be really dusty and I didn't want to clean it. And I went out in the garage after I'd already ordered this and found it in like three seconds and it was like perfectly clean and I found all the minifigures in like four minutes. Like, yeah, so I ordered a sealed one for like 120 bucks, kind of a waste of money. As it turns out, obviously, um, not a bad set necessarily to have a duplicate of and maybe to just hold on and keep sealed. Like the box is in good condition for a collector thing to just put back on the shelf or whatever. But like, yeah, didn't end up needing it like I thought I would. Something really neat I realized with my new chair is I can drop it down low enough to fit under my desk. That's something I could not do with my old chair that saves a lot of space. So that's really nice to have as a thing or an option. All right, Minecraft, Minecraft. I'm gonna start playing Minecraft again here eventually. All right, themes, cause there's also a new um, promo that I wanted to get. This one's new, this one's new, this one's new. Now I know there are more, but right now I think those are the only three. Enemy AC-130 incoming. Anyway, look how freaking nice out it is. Not a cloud, it's a cold front day. Not a cloud in the sky, it's amazing. Oh, hell yeah. So I just opened up the final box of the Coliseum. It was pretty funny because you open the boxes in numbers, like each box is numbered and you get the numbered manual. But the final bag of box three comes in box four. Things that just make sense, right? Like it doesn't make a lick of sense. It should have been in box three with instruction manual three because it's in instruction manual three, but alas, it's in box four, but it's not in instruction manual four. Things that, you know, just, ma just makes a ton of sense to do it that way, right? So yeah, they went through the whole process of making some system to make it easy for you. And then they go and screw it up. Classic Lego. But progress is going well. I'm very happy with this. Um, I like to think I can knock the rest of this out tonight. I need to edit my vlog in another video before I uh, before I build anymore. Or maybe I'll finish this one because I was technically trying to finish box three and this is technically box three. But yeah, um, still a good 10 bags to go. Um, and most of them have extra little bags as well. But a lot of work to go. Thick manuals. You can see this final manual I think is the thickest. So Quite a bit of work yet. Got a few boxes here. Open Sesame. And we're back. What do you know? Uh, so these are the boxes. Um, This is my, oh my god, they just name dropped Grand Admiral Thrawn in Star Wars The Mandalorian. Let me buy a set that I already have a perfectly fine version of and pay $70 for it, even though I could have bought these on clearance at Target two years ago before I'd watched Rebels for like 21 bucks, but I passed because I hadn't watched Rebels and I thought it was trash and I didn't know how much I loved Big Daddy Thrawn. <laughs> I feel uncomfortable saying that. Uh, this is my, oh my god, I've been looking for this Mercari purchase, but I couldn't find it in the store, so eventually I just gave up and bought it on Mercari. I've been wanting to do a video on uh, the knockoff X-Wing thing here. And then some m &R merch, if you will. I got my face mask um, from Mercari, not Mercari, from the place, and it's just got the little blue clone on it. That's all it has, the 501st uh, trooper there. Oh, yeah. Nice and tight. Ooh, fogging up my glasses. Yeah, fits pretty well. Got the little blue clone. I don't know if I'm ever gonna see a Black Series figure in person. I have yet to see one since I started buying them like two weeks ago. I'm still waiting for one to come from GameStop as well. That hasn't shown up either. No Final First Battle Pack. Shocker. This should be my Black Friday Lego.com order that I made last week, so let's check it out. So I know one thing that's in here, but I... I don't know if there's promos in here or not. This was a Black Friday buy. Oh yeah, another one. What does this make? Four of these Charles Dickens sets? I hope these are worth a lot of money next year because I will totally sell them. I got four of them. Damn. I got another one over there that I'm going to open. The other three are getting sold next year when they hopefully are worth like 100 bucks. And then I got 
Vestist wind turbine for 160 bucks. Oh yeah. Just finished recording Ask m &R, so getting that up to Dropbox. Still waiting to uh, figure out the fate of this puppy here one of these days. And then I think I'm gonna have my brother come in, help me record some intros for these videos with the Republic Dropship and ATOT from Republic Bricks, as well as this set that, was his name, Thomas sent me. Um, yeah, Thomas, uh, from 1993, I believe. I got this like a year ago, but I finally, I'm like, okay, I think I have time and I can do it. And then I'm still waiting for two days ago's lego.com order with the Minecraft 2021 sets that hasn't shipped yet that I paid for one to two day shipping. Gotta love it, Lego. I'll be getting my money back once again for the one day shipping as always, it seems. This is why I can't go to Publix. I'll always buy crap that I don't need. Although I do really wanna make some pita pizza. So that's kind of the main reason I came, but yeah, this is bad for you. I don't remember how often I mention this, but from time to time, not very often at all, but from time to time, I'll put cash if I just end up with like extra cash I don't want to carry around in my wallet. I'll put it in a Lego set for like safekeeping. And you know, this is a great idea and all until I forget which Lego set I put like $300 in. Just so you have closure, I was able to remember where I put it. <laughs> so, not in a Lego set. I was really having a hard time trying to remember where the hell I would have put it, but yeah. Hide your money in Lego sets. Good place to hide your money. Unless, of course, you end up in a very unfortunate situation like Republic Attack, in which you would lose both your money and your Lego sets. So on second thought, maybe just like put it in the bank like a normal person. We're out in the garage doing things. And something I noticed... This Mando set has Darth Vader on it. Lego Star Wars can't see, I wanna do a video titled this. They can't, or something similar. They can't seem to do the little things right. You know, like like big picture stuff, they tend to do pretty well. Then you get down to the little things like having the right things just match up on the edge. And yes, it's arbitrary, it doesn't really matter. But it's still a thing. It's about creating a complete package of a product that they completely seem to fail to do time and time again like baby yoda has the mando on the instructions if you see mando on the instructions mando set nope the box has mando but not the instructions you tell me why and then like even the clone wars sets have the clone wars thing on it right like that makes sense i also have out here all the stuff i need to ship all of this needs to be shipped some of them october prizes and stuff that i've been really delaying on um so sorry to those of you guys who won and didn't get your prize yet but you'll get it that's you know it's free so it's coming i'm just slow oh they're done i was in my room and they were all yelling there was another garbage truck in front of them and the guys were yelling at each other oh i'm catching an ice poseidon stream he's driving around the trashiest car trying to uber people it's great lego.com is yet to ship my minecraft 2021 set order so i am actually gonna go to walmart who apparently has the sets right now down in palm bay and buy them shout out to pro lego channel for tipping me off that walmart is the place to be Minecraft sets or we riot. That's all I have to say. Pink Walmart. Dude, I thought I was gonna have to dig. I brought my, my knife because I was like, oh, we're gonna have to open boxes. But no, this was a, this was an easy dub. Is that, isn't that that what they call it, Matt? Yeah, I've been using about a street bike. A str like this? Yeah, I'm like that. <laughs> I do want to buy a bike though. I want to buy like a, probably like a mountain bike, I guess. It's probably one like that. I guess that's a kid's one, but... You know, riding around the streets. Yeah. Wants a new update, or what is it? Ah, they're adding a couple mobs. That's a nice little set. Yeah. I they're just... They're adding a dude that's like... Iron Gold, the Witcher or something? The I heard... The Warden, that's right. I'd yeah, seen someone like talking about that. Well, let's see if... Yeah. I've been looking for uh, the Black there. Series stuff lately. I just started to get into that. I mean Black Series. The Star Wars Black Series. I'll show you. It's actually cool, and you're gonna want to start collecting it too. It's better than Lego because they actually do cool stuff. Like I'm not even kidding. They do. I think after last night's Mandalorian episode, I should buy this, huh? Yeah, go for it. Well, just like it is an investment. Oh yeah. I think it's gonna go up in value. You got nothing else I'm gonna need, huh? No file for travel packs. Uh, nope. Damn. Yeah, I think I really think I might get it. Next series. Well. That might have been it. What? Like that I don't Skywalker? know. No. No, that's not it. I'm talking about the empty brown box. I don't see any black series. 
what does it say it was? Animatronic. Yeah, okay, it wasn't a Black Series then? Animatronic. Um, they don't have any. They rare, it's hard to find them, I've, I've heard. This is one of the Black Series I ordered, but the box got squished like one of those xylophones or instruments, so not too excited about that. But there's some bubbles in there, so there's hope yet, please. Or it's just, oh, no, Fun, dude. It took them 10 days to ship it to me. And this is what you get. Man. The whole point of collecting Black Series me was literally just to have the boxes, like, like on the shelf like this. And that's, this is gonna be a frustrating endeavor, isn't it? So I got most stuff packed, looking pretty damn good. I have to print all the shipping labels and pay for all that. I'm curious, I'll let you know how much all the shipping for all this costs, cause I'm kind of curious too. Uh, I need to go get three more boxes, maybe a fourth. Um, I don't know if I'm actually shipping this one. I don't know if the person that I was gonna send it to got one or not. Well, the Lego aisle has started to actually get wiped and there's only one cantina or Obi-Wan set left. Yeah, all right. Uh, I came here to get boxes instead because the boxes at Walmart were too big. So we're gonna get things that work for what I need. $146 is less than I expected. However, there are still two boxes that I can't get figured out here with one box that's going to Poland and one box that's going to Australia. So those are still gonna cost maybe like another 100 bucks. So maybe call it an even 250 for all 10 packages. All right, we're going to play poker. Also, this control thing is way better than what we used to do is like dig back there and try to get at it, especially when there's stuff around the tree. It's hard to get back there and plug and unplug it. Now you just off, on, off, on. It's pretty great, I like this. So what are we doing here? Taste test, Coke first Pepsi. Sure, Brand new cold can, same cold same on. can. You gotta, hold, hold. I gotta close my eyes, you gotta hand one to me, and I'll tell you what's what. You put one in front of me? Yeah. All right, which one is this? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I can taste the other one. Is this the other one? No, put it right by his hand so he doesn't, there you go. Is this the other one? Yep. No, it's the exact same one. <laughs> Ooh. This is Coke. You're right. Yeah, you're right. That was Pepsi. See, it's easy. It can be done. This is Pepsi. All right. Yeah, yeah winner. There's, there's definitely a difference. We are out of here. I won the poker game. Got 20 bucks. Unfortunately, I missed seven, 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 seven. Real shame. <laughs> there's another one. <laughs> oh, oh. Wait, wait. I can I have. have... 10, 10. That's a dub. That's a dub. I just sniped the crap out of everybody. Easy win. Look, mom, I'm on TV. That's me. Josh, your character's ugly. <laughs> Cam, Halloween was last month. <laughs> Ordered this from Lego on December 1st with one to two day shipping. Today is December 7th. Good job, Lego. But inside, we have three massive Minecraft 2021 sets uh, that I, like I said, already have built and made videos on. So these I'm just actually gonna bring to like a toy drive thing. I'm not gonna keep them myself. I didn't need those as it turns out. Um, also got this VIP gift giving set thing. I won't be using that, at least not this year. I'll just throw that out in the garage. And then the thing I really needed out of this was the Christmas gift thing for this year that you got with over 150 bucks. I don't even know what it's called. It doesn't have a name on it, but it's this year's set kind of akin to last year's Christmas tree. The Creator Pirate Ship. Oh yes, I won't be building this this year, but you know, maybe later in 2021, I'll get around to it. But uh, yeah, it, feel, it, it felt like the right time and it was a good thing to get me over the hump for that promo. So today is the day just who good is coming over he's gonna make a small cameo in the coliseum dropping video so that is happening i also got a couple of packages last night so let's take a look at those but yeah really excited to see that destroyed i'll show you it destroyed after it's destroyed i was still looking for one of those ryan's toy world sets and so i thought hey why don't i look online because remember i had this one i really just needed the frog guy and so, boy, did I find the frog guy in an egg on Mercari. I couldn't believe it. I had to buy them because they're eggs and all the stupid 
toy channels do mystery eggs and I'm like, okay, if I don't have a mystery egg in my Ryan's Toy World video, is it really a Ryan's Toy World video? All right, we're about to work on a thumbnail for this. <laughs> you did not, I was gonna ask you to. <laughs> I have not been recording. Also try it in the wide angle, like press the 0.5 yeah. and then press it back to one. Ooh, I just wanna see. I think the wide angle looks sick. I mean, please, we need to get it in the good angle. Oh, they're just buying me back. I was just gonna sit down and do a, a little vlog talk thing. I let myself die and hit the ground? Probably not. Let's uh, pull the shoot. I'll be right back. So we ended up getting the win on that game. It's a good, good, good way to end the night, I think. Anyway, last night, I did not lock my car. I go out to my car this afternoon to clean it, and uh, somebody went down our street last night Checked all the car doors. Of all the nights, I literally locked my car door like every night, but last night I just didn't. All the nights, didn't lock my car door. Someone came down. The only thing that I can tell that they stole was my phone holder that goes like on my air vent, you know? So I gotta get a new one of those, but I didn't take like any of the papers or anything. So I think they were just looking for money or like anything valuable, but I don't keep anything valuable in my car. Hey, nice job, me. I don't like it either. Huh. Nice. I clean my car and find the thief missed his payday. One penny under the driver's seat. Very nice. All right, Justin's here. We're gonna do the uh, Coliseum drop. I'm very excited. It's gonna be great. He's just making a small cameo. I just thought it'd be funny. Yeah, very small. And then pizza. I don't know where my brother is in the gorilla suit. Did you almost? I saw your hands move towards that head of yours. It is. To... I went up there. <laughs> All over this table. And now it's all full. You started. Those shelves didn't exist either. It used to be a table there That's and just true. sets piled. Right yeah, it's. What? Wasn't there a Hoth set that you were making or something? <laughs> That's it. Under the table. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's what happened. Oh, there it is. Do you have um that one battle pack of the 20th anniversary with the Shadow Trooper? How much? What do you cost? 20 bucks? Yeah. It's up to you. We're making sales. Yeah. My first $20. Hey. Selling Lego. Finally. Woo wee But yeah, I uh, I put a lot of the stuff in, um, I mean, like all this over here is in the plastic um, boxes. Kind of surprised by how much it broke. I just, I, I can't believe it. This looks like, can we find a farther piece? This looks like the farthest piece away from the, the center of the, the explosion over there. Oh wait, oh, yeah, there's a piece? piece right here. Yeah, that looks like a winner. We are pretty far from the, the epicenter. So we destroyed the Coliseum. You can check out that video on the main channel. Justin did not do a very good job I saving it. Awful crash pad offer. Yeah, I mean the worst. But we got to pick up all the pieces now, and then go get pizza. Get it, pieces, pizza. Ha ha ha! Matt just dropped Come a on. banger line. You want to say it again? Because <laughs> <So I counted, laughs> that's all of them. I counted them. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Justin and I are up at uh, Bizarro's on the beach. We can take a peek at the beach after. Uh, let's grab some some food after the destruction. You know, we gotta grieve. Santa Claus at the beach. No way. <laughs> <laughs> and his mistress. Uh, I got the three knots, the cheese. You got the Sicilian, Sicilian the white, white, and the cannoli. cannoli. <laughs> and then he's got his uh, red sauce drink. Red. It is freaking nice out. Eye floaters, Jesus. On the horizon. It is beautiful. Wow. So Justin's heading home. I got the ladder I'm taking back out to the shed here. Put in the secret code. And then uh, we'll be back inside. I'm gonna edit up my, my video real quick because I really want to see the finished product for that. I've been so excited to drop the Coliseum all week. And yeah, I don't know. I've just been really hyped up for that. But let me get all this. I'm back out here because I was watching back the footage and I noticed a lot of pieces went flying this way and I figured we probably didn't get them all and I've already found three pieces so um not bad oh there's a whole chunk there okay it's good I found that because I'm sure oh dude there's so many pieces over here wow we missed a lot of my brother said he checked this wow he also said he counted all the pieces as we were going so I don't know how we could have missed all this it's almost like he didn't count them all <laughs> <laughs> 